A13 one shot, B13 one shot. All that remains is W13 and G13 one shot. What about C13? You're tripping. There is no C13. What would the C even stand for? For a long time, I've been hesitant about making a G13 one shot. Do I work towards completing the set and having all the hunt one shots under my belt, but consequently have to endure the comment saying it's pointless and not to farm Golem? But like a guardian angel answering my call, Smilegate has buffed the Golem sets. So now, could Golem Gaming be viable? Selectively, sure. But more importantly, I now have a video. And if you've seen my previous one-shot videos, you may have realized that these are all heroes belonging to other teams. So pretty nice that I could achieve this with no dedicated effort. Too bad W13 isn't this easy. Anyways, that's enough for an introduction, let's get into the stats. First up, Bologna, calm down, she doesn't need 260 speed for Golem. She has that speed for A13, I have her at plus 15 because she was my second ever nat 5, and I'm running her on Midnight Bloom because since I'm using a lot of non-red heroes, they need the crit chance. I also have her on the second EE to give her 100% chance of defense breaking, and besides being the fastest person on the team, the only other important stat is effectiveness and she only needs to hit 65. So that way she can only get resisted 15% at the time. Next, MLT area, I have her tuned to go before Vivian, and besides hitting 65 effectiveness, her main use comes from the fact that she's a free plus 15 unit, and she has a defense break on her S2. Nothing super notable about her other stats, oh, and she's got the artifact that increases team attack, but that's mainly for B13, I doubt she even needs it for G13. Next up, Vivian, who has now shown up in every Hunt 13 one-shot video of mine I've made so far. Pretty crazy versatility. She's mainly just an attack buffer to be honest, with as much DPS stats as I could get while still being relatively fast. Finally, Soul, you don't need to put any speed on him, just go all out on attack and crit damage, with at least 85 crit damage, less if you're running Midnight Bloom. And yeah, that's all. See ya for Wyvern.